Welcome back, all you beautiful patriots out there, man. I'm so happy to see you guys. I'm off a of suspension, man. I'm super happy to see you guys. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff from you guys. Don't forget to share the video. Don't forget to call me Mr. Conservative. And yes, patriots, so I am going to make this video as quick as possible for you guys. I know you guys are important people with a butt ton of stuff that you need to do. But patriots, I truly, truly do appreciate every last one of you guys from the bottom of my heart, you guys. So what I want to do here, you guys, is I want to take a moment here and I want to put the spotlight directly on Joe Biden and his administration, you guys with this proposal of paying the illegal immigrants that got separated from their their mother and child and father and child or whatever that whole mumbo jumbo you guys they are proposing to pay each one of them four hundred and fifty thousand dollars something of that sort you guys i may be off by a couple dollars but yeah four hundred and fifty thousand dollars we'll just round it up and say like a half a million because that's a half a million right damn there right but the crazy thing about this whole entire situation, the crazy thing about this whole entire situation, you guys, is that they are saying because of emotional distress. Well, I have a question to ask. What about the emotional distress of the American children who get ripped from their parents? Because, yes, it does happen. For the ones who have to be like, oh, Tyrone, Tyrone, that does never happen. Yes, it does. People commit crimes. They get separated from their children. There's false allegations made against parents and their child is ripped from them there are some parents who can't provide enough meals or they don't have a stable home and that state rips them from them so what about those children are you going to pay them four hundred and fifty thousand dollars right are you going to pay them four hundred and fifty thousand dollars somebody please answer the question for me because you know what man this is super crazy i don't think they deserve one red cent because for the simple fact is they broke the law they broke the law if you break the law you go to jail simple as that right if i get arrested right now right and my kids are in the car with me and i'm drinking and driving what do you think is going to happen what do you think is going to happen they're going to take me to jail they're, what they're going to do if they can't get a hold of anybody else they're going to notify family service they're going to notify dcfs and you best believe i'm going to be having a dcfs case if i was driving around intoxicated with my kids in the car would you you know what i mean real talk that's the same concept that's applied here you knew the chances you knew what was going to happen you knew it now a lot of people say oh well tyrone they were seeking a better life they were seeking asylum well okay well come to the point of entry come to the point of entry like hey i need i need help I need help. But instead, you try to sneak in through the back door, and that's exactly what they were trying to do. Sneak in through the back door, right, and go unnoticed. They were just going to disappear into the, the mainframe of our country. That's what they were going to do. Real talk. This is crazy, Patriots. This is crazy. This, I don't understand. I do not understand how any Democrat out there that's still out there that still support this man. Right? Because look, he's destroying our economy. He's destroying our country. He's pushing all of this mumbo jumbo that makes no sense. And hey, Patriots, check it out. That money that they're going to pay these people, that's your taxpaying dollars. That is your dollars. And hey, check it out. They just proposed like a Patriot tax. Do you guys hear about the Patriot tax? Yeah, they want to tax us 15%. Now, they have not passed it, but this is just a suggestion that they are pushing through. So, not also that you want to tax me more but you want to give my money to illegal aliens right who broke the law coming into this country crazy right crazy crazy and then you know what to my brothers and sisters man to my brothers and sisters and yes i am talking to pacific ones and i'm not going to mention your names okay for the ones that i used to debate all the time about reparations where's where's your reparation what did joe biden do for you because it showed look like he ain't doing nothing for you my brother real talk Real talk. You know, you know what he is going to do when election time come around. They're going to talk about it. They're going to bring it up. They're going. That's that's all they're going to do. But they can go ahead and get four hundred and fifty thousand dollars to to some immigrants who broke our laws, violating our country. You know what I mean? Yeah, they'll do that. They'll do that. But you, nah, they ain't got nothing because you know why? You know why? They don't have to do nothing for you because they are. They know you're going to vote Democrat. That's that's that, that's facts on top of facts. They know you're gonna vote Democrat. They already know it. They got they got your vote in the bag. They already counted your vote before you cast your vote. Real talk. That's what they that's what they think. What are they gonna do is pander to you when when election time come up. That's all they're gonna do is pander. This is crazy, Patriots. This is crazy. And I swear to God Almighty, Patriots. I swear to God Almighty. If they go through. And give these people four hundred and fifty thousand dollars, man. I am going to lose my freaking mind. Real talk, 
real talk. And no, YouTube, I'm not making a threat. I'm just saying I am going to go crazy. Because this is crazy. I am working hard, hard, hard for my money. I, I average maybe about $45,000 a year. You're going to give these people, you're going to give these people $450,000. $450,000 and I make about roughly anywhere from 45 to to you know around that marker. You know what I mean? A year. A year. I'm struggling taking care of my family. Real talk. Emotional distress. I got a lot of emotional distress. And maybe I should sue the government for the emotional distress that Joe Biden put me through for the last past 10 months. Yeah, maybe I should sue him. Let's settle out of court, Joe. Yeah, I'll settle right now for 250000 Look, it's a fraction of what you're going to give them. It's a fraction. It's half. Pay up. Real talk, Patriots. Real talk. Uh, this is crazy. I'm telling you, these lefty loonies, they're, they're super crazy, man. They do not know what they're doing. All right? They're destroying our country. They're eroding our constitution. They don't care about you. They don't care about me. Real talk. They, they, they can care less. Real talk. But, oh, yeah, Tyrone, it's an emotional distress. So where's your empathy? What empathy? What are you talking about? Yeah, I feel bad for him. I feel bad for him. But hey, I feel bad for the people on Skid Row. I feel bad for our active military. I feel bad for our vets who come home and they don't get no programs. You know what I mean? Like real talk. They get thrown to the side. I feel bad for them. That's who I really feel bad for. For our vets who went, lost, lo lost loved ones, lost, lost legs and limbs. You know, real talk. Defending this country, this great nation. That's who I feel bad for. Real talk. What about the children? What about the children of our vets? What about them? What about them? Who's going through it? What about them? You know, real talk, Patriots. I mean, I know I went everywhere on this video, but it really grinds a gear. It really pees me off. $450,000. Just think about that. Just think about what you could possibly do with $450,000. Just imagine what other, no, what, look, they want to get that new infrastructure, right? That whole, uh, that whole infrastructure plan that they're trying to push right now. And they're proposing to give this to each person, not just 400,000, I'm sorry, $450,000 and they all split it. No, he proposing to give them each $450,000 each. What can we do with that money? What can this nation do with that money? I don't know. We can make more programs here to take care of our vets. How about that? You guys want to push a whole bunch of other equality stuff here? Why don't you use that money that you're going to just give away? Why don't you just use that money? But no, no, Patriots. That ain't how it works when it comes to the Democrats. What they're going to do is they're going to spend your money, and then they're going to spend my kids' money, and then they're going to spend their grandkids' money, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. See, they're going to just keep spending everybody else's money because they don't worry about it, because it's not their money. Real talk. I am sick and tired of this, Patriots. Sick and tired. The economy's in the tank. Real talk. They're proposing to give butt ton of money out to people who broke our laws. Real talk. Um, they don't care about our military. Real talk. They don't care about our vets. They don't care about them. Right? While the average American middle class is suffering, yeah, we're, sh we're just swept underneath the rug. Right? And you know who's paying for all these programs? Me. You. Your kids. Your grandkids. And their kids. And their kids. And their kids. That is who's paying for it. And it really, 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 really grinds a, grinds a gear, Patriots. Real talk. Gas prices are high, right? The unemployment rate is, is somewhat up. I don't know what it is now. I haven't checked it. But yeah, last time I checked, it was sky high too. <laughs> you know what I mean? It costs more money for me to heat my house, to power up my house. It costs me more money to drive to work. You know what I mean? You're taking more money out of my check. And you're proposing more taxes and more taxes on the middle class American while you're going to give away $450,000 away for free to pretty much criminals because that's what they are. You're a criminal if you break the law. If I break the law, I'm a criminal. Real talk. Matter of fact, I am a criminal. I'm a criminal because I have broke the law in the past. You know, real talk. This doesn't make no sense, Patriots. It makes no sense whatsoever. But you know what? It's our taxpayer dollars, right? They don't care because it's not their money. And that's the problem. 
That is that that is a key problem right there. I honestly think that some of these Democrats, if they was putting like, I don't know, 30% of their income into it or even more. You know what I mean? Even more. If they were putting their money and it, if it was their money that they had to actually spend on some of these programs, I think they were second guessing. Real talk. They always say that they're going to tax the rich, right? That's what the Democrats said. We're for the poor people. We're going to tax the rich. But you know what? You're not taxing the rich because I, if I'm not mistaken, I believe they just gave them a tax break. So the tax break is this is this this is how they get the tax break, okay? For the wealthy. Because they have what is called like loopholes in the system, right? So they got like tax write-offs. So you can write things off and claim a loss and it will make you pay less federal taxes. In a nutshell, that's how it goes, okay? Now, they proposed this bill for the wealthy, right? If you pay your state taxes, you can now claim that as a tax write-off on your federal taxes. So you can claim your state taxes, right, on your federal taxes. That is a blessing for the rich. Can I do that? Can I do that? Can I claim my... Because it wouldn't even matter anyways. It, I, I don't even think it would matter with me. You know, like I said, $45,000 a year, average American, right? Average American, $45,000 a year. And a matter of fact, and that's... I probably make a little bit more now because I got, I got two jobs now, but I digress. But yeah, you know what I mean? Crazy. Crazy, Patriots. Crazy. I don't want to make a super long video for you guys. I know you guys are important people. I'm going to end the video, but please comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this. $450,000. We can do so much more with $450,000 each person, but you're just going to give it away. Just give it away. I'm pretty sure, Democrats, you can find something better to spend that money on. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I mean, you guys got all these fantastic guys. Well, what about the Green New Deal? The Green New Deal. You want to go, you want to save the environment, right? You want to push all this green energy. Why won't you use that money and stop using my taxpayer money? Well, that money is my, my money, so I guess it doesn't matter, right? Oh, man. So I'm going to end the video, you guys, with a let's make America great. Let's keep America great. And come on in here, and let me tell you how we're going to do that. We're going to make America great, and we're going to keep America great by giving these Democrats out of office. They got to go. They got to go, Patriots. They got to go because they are messing up the country. That's what's going to keep America great. That's definitely what's going to make America great. And I'll be coming back at you guys with another video.